everyone, HMD Brick Customs here with another haul video, but before we get started on that, it's time to show off some more figures that you guys sent in. So 3322Bob over on Instagram has struck yet again with his figures. First of all, we have an updated Stargazer, and he did test out the arms like I suggested. We also have another variation of Stargazer. Here is an updated Alfred and an updated black and blue Batman. We got Sandman, and I really do enjoy the detail you gave him. Bruce Banner. Haha, <laughs> here's the one and only Shrek himself. Up next is Toymaker and Mr. Fantastic. And I really want official figures of the Fantastic Four, but I am certain it will happen eventually. From the Middle Earth line, we have Gandalf. Here is Doc Ock, a Stormtrooper, Cyborg, Dr. Phil, Flash, Leonard Snart, aka Captain Cold. Steve Rogers is present, and I am absolutely loving the weathering detail. And then the last two figures that 3322Bob submitted are Bane and Brainiac. LEGO P3 sent me his Arkham Knight Batman, Cyborg, and Nightwing, all of which look fantastic. Very wise choice for Nightwing's legs. OTC Studios made an amazing weather wizard. The Killer Croc torso as well. Killer. And he looks great alongside the other figures OTC created, being Alchemy and Brainiac. Edgar Mora submitted some marvelous Marvel figures, starting with Doc Ock. The torso and legs that were used here are just absolutely genius, and you did a really sick job with the tentacles. Doc Ock is also present in the Sinister Six picture. My main focus registers on Vulture. I mean, look at the wings. Perfection. The final figure Edgar made was a comic-based whiplash, and yet again, amazing part usage. Cyberman's torso and legs really do bring this figure justice. It's Thomas 17, grouped up his Legion of Doom, which includes Mirror Master, Sinestro, Metallo, Reverse Flash, Cheetah, Deathstroke, and Black Manta. David Lego Lab 1002 made the homemade Spider-Man suit. It looks absolutely stunning and makes me wonder yet again why Lego did not give us an official one. Juan Villacorta is also back with his rogues, fantastic group made up of Captain Cold, Trickster, Mirror Master, Thinker, Heatwave, and Weather Wizard. He also sent in Black Bolt, which is just perfect. He is actually a figure I've been waiting on LEGO to make. Fingers crossed that it will one day happen, and he is alongside Mysterio. The final figure today comes from Larissa Chanel, and this is in-game Thor, so once again, you all did an amazing job. It's always great to see what you guys make, and now let's get started on the haul. Don't you guys just love mail days? Because I know I sure do. So, let's see what I got. First package is from Bricklink. Okie dokie. Little Phoenix. So let's take a look at these pieces. I got uh, Ocean Master's torso. And then Cad Bane's hat. Hanzo's head. Hanzo's head. Let's get these more on camera. Um, this Star Wars head, I didn't order that, but, uh, we got that head. I'll have to see what that was supposed to be, if it was supposed to be something. So, as you can see, it was supposed to be Quillen Voss's head, not Simon Mizrani, so I'm gonna have to contact them about this. Harley Quinn's legs, Magneto hair, some Aquaman heads, this hair, uh, Star Wars parts. Kylo Ren's head and that hair, uh, whatever her face is, head is from that Star Wars battle pack, legs, Flash's head, a green balaclava, and a cowboy hat. Next package is from Minifig Madness, and it is going to be Daredevil, I assume. Okay, so Daredevil is my favorite Marvel character, and I just had to get this custom printed one. So there he is, and there's Minifig Madness's business card. And here we got the final package. We got Cyborg's torso, this rebel head, oh my, uh, Ghost's head, this torso, and these legs. So yeah, that's it for this opening. Hey everyone, I'm back with some more packages, and I usually don't show these big ones because, as you can tell, they don't really fit on my table, but I'm just showing that I do buy sets. I don't just get parts, I do buy sets, but like I said, they don't always fit on my table, so that's why I usually don't show myself opening big packages, but let's see what this one is. 
and it was this Star Wars Freemaker set. Another step closer to getting all of the Star Wars sets. I am pretty close, to be honest, actually. I want to say I need about like 50-ish more sets. And you might be like, 50 sets? That's a lot. But considering how big the Star Wars line is, that's pretty good. The next package has no return address. So we will see what this is. Okay, it's from, I want to say, Wordnoff over on Flickr. Uh, hello HMD for Customs, it's your order from Flickr, Word Off. Included are the Green Lantern head, torso, and legs. Zod torso, Lego Movie 2 Wild Style scarf, and two Brick Forge pistols. I also threw in two freebies, a Lego Batman Movie Green Arrowhead, and a Brick Forge splat piece. I'm a big fan of your Flickr, Insta, and YouTube. In fact, your channel is one of the very few that I've turned on notifications for, outside of Jane Bricks and Mini Superheroes Today. Love your DC figure series. I'm constantly upgrading my own figures from those videos. Thank you for, or thanks for doing business with me, and I'm sure you'll put these parts to good use. Aw, oh, thank you so much. Uh, that's really nice. So, the pieces that were, ooh, bricks and minifigs. That's kind of cool. Uh, but yeah, here are the pieces that I got sent. Uh, the, that was a freebie, he said. And then that was a freebie, but yeah, I can't wait to put these to use. So that's it for this opening. Okay, I got two more packages. One is from Sam's Figs over on Instagram, and one is from Fink Bricks over on Bricklink. And let's get started with the one from Sam's Figs. So it is Link from Outside Brick, and I'm so thankful he was able to sell me his. I had the opportunity to buy this a while back, but I missed out on it, and I regret it. But I did have to pay a little extra to get him than what I would have originally had to pay, but I'm just so thankful I was able to pick him up. So thank you so much, Sam's Figs. And here are the parts from Fink Bricks. We got a blue Batman cowl, the series 14 Tiger Lady legs, these legs from the One Jedi from whatever shuttle that's called, uh, another one of these classic smiling faces, I really like those, uh, magenta helmet, this hair, and then that head. So yeah, that's it for this opening. Hello everyone, I am back with some more packages. We got something from uh, Brickland, we got some more stuff from Kohl's, and then a couple boxes from eBay. So let's get started on the opening. Here we got the package from Brickland. And it is from Cobb's Cheap Brick House. So as you can see, I got a Stormtrooper, and then Jack-14, a couple of uh, Yellow Lantern torsos, here is uh, Mr. Good and Evil's legs, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, Balaclava piece, and then we got two of the Smiling Heads, a uh, yellow hat, that head, and a brown hat, and then I got this helmet. Thank you so much for your order. If you have any issues with this order, please contact me and I will make it right. Please consider leaving positive feedback. It means a lot to me to know you are happy with your order. Enjoy your Lego Cobb. So yeah, that's pretty nice. Here is Cole. Got six more minifigure packets. First one is the pizza guy. So there he is. Next up we got Rugby Player. And then here we have uh, the Bear. And this one is going to be the Cyclist. The Gardener Lady. And the last package is The Mummy. Okay, next package is from eBay, and this is not going to be a Lego, by the way. And it was Nacho Libre Funko Pop. 
Final package is from eBay and it is a Lego and uh, we're not looking too good on this. So I did buy this used because it was like super duper cheap, like $17. Oh my goodness. Uh, got this Y-Wing. But I really wish it was disassembled. Would have provided for a lot better ah, shipping. Seriously, what's up with this? So that's going to be fun uh, reassembling. And this is why you ship disassembled so it doesn't get bent up and broken like this. So, uh, replacement parts, here I come. But yeah, that's it for this opening. Thank you guys so much for watching. It really does mean a lot. If you enjoyed, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more content. That's all. Until next time, thanks for watching. Goodbye.